And this wave will pull out of the Rockies tonight, uh, work its way eastward through the day tomorrow, eventually spreading clouds our way and even some gusty wind returning as we get into tomorrow night. In fact, I'll fast forward this to tomorrow afternoon. I do expect these wind gusts to start increasing through the afternoon. Not too windy tomorrow, but breezy by the afternoon. Tomorrow evening, a little gusty around, but it's later into tomorrow night. As we get into 9, 10, 11 o'clock, that's when these winds will start picking up. Back into the upper 30s, possibly as high as 40 miles per hour uh, tomorrow night. Now, this will be warmer air building in, so it's going to be gusty wind with warm air and even a few rain showers around into the start of your Saturday morning. Uh, still gusty, especially early Saturday and even into the afternoon. Uh, that'll start letting up, but overall turning much colder behind a cold front that works its way through uh, with that western storm system. So here's how we get there. Temperatures sitting around freezing or below right now. I do expect these to settle as we get into tonight. Future Tracker shows you those temperatures sliding on down back into the mid-20s by tomorrow morning. Now, I do expect mainly clear skies tonight. Toward morning, we'll see some clouds trying to slip in. And as the day goes on, I do expect those clouds to thicken up as we go through the afternoon. But temperatures get back above freezing. In fact, we'll climb in the low to mid-40s here through the afternoon. And then it just keeps warming up uh, through tomorrow evening and tomorrow night. Now, later into the evening, there's a tiny chance we get a sprinkle to pop up. I don't expect a whole lot. It's later tomorrow evening into especially the overnight hours. That's when the chance of rain showers start building in with the gusty wind around, and those showers will be around on and off into the start of your Saturday, and then the cold front comes through. So our high temperature on Saturday will be in the morning, and then the temperature starts falling through the day. And at the same time, uh, we'll start drying out too. So the best chance of any precipitation Saturday would be in the morning, maybe a flurry or a snow shower Saturday evening into Saturday night up into the northern snow belt. Uh, but the rest of the area, just some clouds around and some blustery wind. Uh, temperatures tonight down to 24. Clear skies expected at tomorrow's high temperature at 46 degrees. Degrees. Clouds increase overall and becoming breezy through the afternoon. A windy into tomorrow night and early Saturday. The high Saturday will be 50, but that's in the morning. It's going to fall pretty quickly. We'll be close to freezing by late Saturday.